Hello and welcome to Miller Realty Group's Talk of the Town at Carolinas. I'm your host, Patty Mercer. Hey, are you ready for the holidays? Well, this edition of Talk of the Town Carolinas is guaranteed to get you ready. That's right, we're gonna check out something really fun. Hey, and if you're thinking about selling or buying a new home, simply call Carmen Miller or visit carolinahomesearch.com. While you're there, you can see past episodes of Talk of the Town, Carolinas. You ready? Let's go check out the Christmas shop at the Humane Society of York County. Come on, babes. And you are? I am Elaine Siegel. I am the chief elf of the Christmas store and this year's Halloween boutique. This is an offshoot of our Possibilities Thrift Shop, and it's all for the Humane Society of York County. Well, we love being here, and I'm always amazed at the inventory that you have. Hol let's see, Halloween Boutique mm -hmm. Christmas Store. Where does all this come from? Good question. It all comes from people who donate. It all goes to the uh, Possibilities Thrift Shop, and we price it and we put it in storage so we have it available by Halloween and Christmas time. But it's all from our wonderful donors in the area. So the um, Humane Society of York County mm -hmm. has a Possibility Thrift Shop which is open year round. Yes it is. This Christmas store and Halloween boutique is opening when? October 1st and it will be here through December 27th. The Halloween Boutique will be here through Halloween. At that time, the boutique will become the Christmas Boutique for all those special dresses and outfits to wear for Christmas. How does it then go towards helping the fur babies? Well, of course, you know, we have a huge budget for our fur babies and they want to eat every day, we found. <laughs> really? <laughs> and we have medical expenses. Of course, we have our staff that we pay. We do have a lot of volunteers up at, at the Humane Society also. But it all, all this money goes toward the animals and to anything for the benefit of the animals. About how many volunteers does it take? How many elves does it take how many to elves? create <laughs> a, a, a workshop such as this? We have probably about 75 elves. Wow. And we, we have been setting up since September 1st. Uh, this is a time of COVID-19. Yes. What precautions are you taking to ensure uh, the, the most possible safe shopping experience okay well first of all everyone is required to wear a mask no exceptions we won't let anybody in the door without a mask because we know the mask works we also will have social distancing uh, for checkout uh, and we'll practice social distancing as much as we can we'll be cleaning whenever we can it we want our customers and we want, want our volunteers to be safe because the average age of our volunteers is over 70. So it's mo mostly so important that our volunteers are safe also. You're also at a very unique location. We are. Tell me about how you ended up here. <clears throat> well, three years ago, and this is our third year at Big Fireworks, three years ago we put on Facebook that we needed a location, a large location, and one of the people that worked for Big Fireworks at the time, she contacted us after she spoke to the owner and they said, yeah, we would love to have you. He's very, very generous. He gives us all the space. <clears throat> it's free. Uh, he pays the power. We, we are in here without paying anything so that 100% of our money goes to the animals. If you can find the Fort Mill School District office, you are so close. Right right next door to the Fort Mill School yes. District offices off of Gold Hill Road on Deerfield. And the hours of operation. Okay. Um, the hours of operation are Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 12 to 4. Friday's a longer day, it's 10 to 6.30, so if you need to do some evening shopping. Saturdays are 10 to 4, and Sundays are 12 to 4. We are closed on Monday. Easy enough. Is there anything that I haven't asked you that you would like to share with us? Please come, please support us. Our goal this year is $90,000 for the, and it all goes to the animals. Well, that's it for this edition of Miller Realty Group's Talk of the Town, Carolinas. Hey, if you're thinking of buying or selling your home, just call Carmen or check out a lot of listings by simply going to carolinahomesearch.com. While you're there, you can see past episodes of Talk of the Town, Carolinas. And when it comes to Christmas, don't forget the Christmas Store and Halloween Boutique for the Humane Society of York County. Where is that elf? Hey, until next time, I'm Patty Mercer. Bye-bye. <laughs>